Okay, it's 12 o'clock. Welcome everybody um, to our third Munch and Learn series with Mental Health America of Hawaii. My name is Janice. I am a student at UH Manoa and I have had the amazing privilege and experience to be interning this summer with Mental Health America Hawaii and all of its fabulous people. Um, so today we are going to be covering progressive muscle relaxation. Um, it's also referred to as paired muscle relaxation. I will be referring to it as PMR from here on out because it's kind of a long, a long uh, phrase. Um, but what it is is a distress tolerance skill or a tool that we can use to relieve stress and anxiety. And if you've ever had an ache in your back or neck pain, I carry a lot of stress in my neck. Um, when we're feeling stressed or anxious, it's totally a normal response for our body. And when we are stressed, it's actually our autonomic nervous system that induces this fight or flight response you may have heard of. And a lot of the time we're not aware of this. So when we hear about all of these detrimental effects of stress and anxiety, like a compromised immune system or insomnia, this is kind of what they're referring to. And so PMR can actually blunt this and how it's done is we're combining these repetitive release of mus muscle trips, sorry, muscle tension, and then also breathing. And so let's try this really quickly, um, just a quick demonstration if you wanna do it with me. Um, make a fist and we're gonna clench the muscles in our hands tightly, but not too tightly. If you feel your nails are digging into your palm, you're, you're clenching too hard. Basically, we want to make enough tension that we can feel it. And then as we're holding this, let's take a breath in, a deep breath in through our nose. So one, two, three, four. Hold it for just a second. And then when I mention to exhale, relax your hand. And so let's do it, relax and exhale. So you might be feeling the blood rushing back into your hands or at least um, notice the tension relaxing or dissipating in your hand immediately. And so what we're doing is we want to contract these muscles. And again, we don't want to do them too tightly. We definitely want to avoid any pain or cramp cramps. Um, but think about how that felt. And so with that relaxation, we can, with daily practice, sort of turn this into a habit. So um, since I've been introduced to this, I'll, while I'm working on my laptop, I'll uh, practice it while doing homework. You can also practice this before bed. And there are lots of scripts um, online that can guide you. And actually this session is being recorded and it'll be uploaded to YouTube and you'll also be emailed a link later. Um, so you can also practice with me again, if you'd like. So without further ado, let's get started. Um, you can do this either sitting down uh, at your desk, or if you can, you can also try it lying down. And also this is your time to relax. So let your hands rest loosely in your lap or by your side. And we're gonna breathe in while we're relaxing. Breathe out slowly, and when you're ready, you can close your eyes. When you're relaxing, we're gonna breathe in smoothly and deeply. Take a breath in, and as you breathe out slowly again, imagine yourself becoming heavier and heavier. You're gonna sink in your chair or where you are lying down and you're gonna keep breathing rhythmically. And as you're breathing, you're gonna feel a sense of relief and letting go. Try saying to yourself, relax as you breathe out. And then let's breathe like this for a few moments more. Now begin to relax the muscles of your body. Think of your feet. Let your feet go limp. 
feel the tension draining away from your feet. And let your feet roll out outwards and grow heavier and heavier. Imagine that they're so heavy that they're sinking into the floor as you become more and more relaxed and growing heavier and more relaxed. And now let's do that again. We're going to think of our feet and we're gonna clench our feet as we're breathing in and we're going to hold it. And as we exhale, we're gonna release that tension in our feet and feel that tension draining away. Now let's think about our calves. If you're sitting down, you can let your feet touch the floor, let your legs get heavy, and we're going to clench the muscles in our thighs. We're gonna hold it for a second, breathing in. And as you exhale, we're gonna relax those calf muscles. Our calves are gonna feel heavy as we relax them, draining that tension away, leaving them feeling heavy and limp. Imagine your legs and feet are so heavy that they're sinking into the floor or wherever you're lying down. They feel limp and relaxed, growing more heavy and relaxed. We're gonna do that again. Let's clench the muscles as we're breathing in of our calves. We're gonna hold it, hold our breath. And then as you exhale, relax the tension in your calves. Notice how the tension is draining away. They're feeling heavy and limp. And imagine that your legs and feet are so heavy that they're sinking into the floor, limp and relaxed, growing more and more heavy. And then we're going to think about our thigh muscles. We take the next inhale, we're gonna clench our thigh muscles. We're gonna hold our breath for a second as we're clenching. And then exhale, relax. Our thighs feel limp and heavy. Your calves also feel heavy. Your feet feel heavy. Imagine the tension draining away leaving your legs, leaving them feeling limp and relaxed, leaving them feel so heavy that they're sinking into the floor or your chair. Let the feelings of relaxation spread up from your feet, up through your legs, relaxing your hips and lower back. Take a breath in, take a breath out. And now let's relax the muscles of your hips and lower back. If you feel any tension, let it go. Let your muscles relax. Your spine is supported. You're feeling those muscles relax deeper and deeper. More and more relaxed growing heavier and heavier. Your hips are relaxed. Your legs are relaxed. Your feet are heavy. Tension is draining away from your body. Again, let's clench. And then relax the muscles of your hip and lower back. Really feel that tension letting go. Our muscles relaxed. Again, your spine is supported. We're growing heavier and heavier. 
our hips are relaxed, our legs are relaxed, our feet are heavy, and tension is draining away from your body. And now we're going to focus on our stomach and our chest muscles. As we breathe in, we can clench our stomach and breath in our chest. And when we exhale, we're gonna let go of that tension. You're gonna feel your stomach muscles relax. Feel the tightness leave your chest. As you breathe evenly and calmly, your chest and stomach should gently rise and fall. Allow your breathing to become rhythmic and relaxed. We'll do that again. We're going to clench our stomach and chest muscles as we can as we're breathing in. Hold that breath for just a second. And then exhale and feel the stomach muscles relax. Feel the tightness leave your chest. As you breathe evenly and calmly, your stomach and chest should gently rise and fall. And now we're gonna think of our hands and our arms. If you can, Gently raise your arms to your shoulders. Take a deep breath in with our arms raised, our hands by our shoulders. And then when you're ready on your exhale, gently release your arms back to your sides or in your lap. And imagine the tension draining away from your arms leaving your upper arms, leaving your forearms, draining away from your hands. Your arms feel heavy. Your arms feel limp and relaxed. And then when you're ready on the next inhale, we're going to lift our arms again, our hands by our shoulders. Clench that muscle as we hold our breath. And then on the exhale, gently let your arms fall by your side or in your lap. And again, imagine that tension draining away from your arms, leaving your upper arms, leaving your forearms, draining away from your hands. Your arms feel heavy. They feel limp and relaxed. Now let's think about the muscles in our shoulders. If you can, let's scrunch our shoulders up to our ears as we're inhaling. And as we bring them up to our ears, we're gonna hold our breath, hold it. And then as we exhale, let them drop. If you're sitting, let your head drop forward. As our shoulders drop, we're gonna drop them even further. We're gonna feel the tension easing away from our neck and shoulders. We're gonna feel our muscles relaxing more and more deeply. Your neck is limp and your shoulders feel heavy. And then on the next inhale, we're going to scrunch our shoulders up again to our ears. We're gonna think about these muscles in our shoulders as we're holding them. And then on your next inhale, relax. Let them drop. Let your head drop forward if you're sitting again. Let your shoulders drop even further. And we're feeling that tension ease away from our neck and shoulders. Our muscles are becoming more and more relaxed. Our neck is limp and our shoulders feel heavy. And then we're going to think about our face muscles. Focus on the muscles running across your forehead. If you can, scrunch them up. Hold them for just a second. And when we exhale, 
Relax your forehead and drop your jaw. Feel the strain easing. Feel the tension draining away from your face. Your forehead feels smooth and relaxed. Your jaw is heavy and loose. Imagine that tension leaving your face, leaving your neck, draining away from your shoulders. Your head, neck, and shoulders feel heavy and relaxed. And then again, we're going to think about our face muscles and we're gonna focus again on the muscles across our forehead. If you can, scrunch up your forehead, hold it, and as we exhale, relax those forehead muscles. Drop your jaw and feel that strain easing. Feel the tension draining away from your face. Your forehead is smooth and relaxed. Your jaw heavy and loose. Imagine the tension leaving your face. The tension is leaving your neck, draining away from your shoulders. Your head, neck, and shoulders feel heavy and relaxed. Now let's think of our whole body. Your entire body feels heavy and relaxed. Let go of any tension. Imagine that tension flowing out of your body. Listen to the sound of your calm, even breathing. Your arms, legs, and head feel pleasantly heavy. Too heavy to move. You may feel as though you're floating. Let it happen. This is part of being relaxed. When images drift into your mind, don't fight them. Just acknowledge it and let them pass. You're a bystander, interested but not involved. Keep breathing and enjoy those feelings of relaxation for a few moments more. And if you like, you can picture something that gives you pleasure and a sense of calm. And in just a moment, I'm going to count backwards from four to one. And when I reach one, open your eyes and lie still for a little while before you can begin to move around again. You'll feel pleasantly relaxed and refreshed. Four, beginning to feel more alert. Three, getting ready to start moving again. Two, becoming aware of your surroundings. And then one, eyes open, feeling relaxed and alert. So how was it? I see in the comments, someone can feel the blood rushing throughout their body. That's awesome. So that was a snippet into PMR. Oh, good. I'm glad it felt great. Ah, yes, relaxing. So this is a really good exercise that we can use. Absolutely daily practice. You'll definitely start feeling the effects. Um, the more we practice, just like all of our Munch and Learns, this is just an added tool that you can add to your toolbox, something that you can practice and, you know, use as a form of self-care even. We have just a minute. Huh, someone almost fell asleep. That's so great. And absolutely, yes. <laughs> we'll be sending a copy of this video shortly. You should be getting an email. It is, it's like, it does feel like taking a good nap because our body is relaxed. And then when we suddenly come back to slowly start moving and becoming aware of our surroundings again, we should also feel pretty um, relaxed and refreshed. 
Yeah, face relaxation as well. Absolutely. I know for me, I keep a lot of tension in my jaw. Um, so this one really helps, like just being aware of that and then letting it go. It's a good practice. It's a good habit. I'm so sorry someone can't see me. Could be my computer, but I know you can hear me. So that's most important. Oh, thank you. Well, if there aren't any questions, um, Dr. G, if you have any closing remarks. Awesome job as usual. Yes, Janice does a fantastic job with relaxation. Her voice is very soothing, which is why we love for her to do this for us. We will all be getting a taped version of this in the email. We provided that when you came in. Um, it will also connect you to the playlist that will have the past Munch and Learns and also where you will find future Munch and Learns posted. And so if you weren't able to see it, you will be getting that video and audio in that taping. And we'll be able to get that sent to you. Oh, thank you. Amanda has dropped that already into the chat. Um, but yes, we'll be able to get that out to you hopefully by end of today, but no later than tomorrow. Well, thank you so much, everybody, for attending. I'm so happy to see your comments. And